Who's there? Is anyone there? I see you. Shell rises from stasis inside of a glass box. She isn't greeted by faces, only concrete and clocks. That's when she first hears Gladys, computer that talks. She's told to leave the little room, but has no shoes and no socks. She trusted the computer cause the voice sounded nice So she traveled through the center and followed all its advice But when she starts tasting blood, she started thinking twice It was the first time that she used a handheld portal device She put some holes in the walls, then the ceiling, then the floors It was a weapon to create interdimensional doors Still the test keep getting harder and she needs Needed a break. That's when the voice began to barter with the promise of cake. Somebody cut the cake. Gladys had a wicked habit of enhancing the truth Shell knew not to expect to get to see any proof She had a sneaking suspicion that the cake was a spoof Yet she continued on her mission on account of her sweet tooth Three tests to finish, she was nearing the end She met Companion Cube and they became the best of friends But as with anything good, this thing was too good to last She had to burn her best friend to be allowed to pass Gladys realized her spirit was far too strong to break She had completed all the tests and never made a mistake Her mouth began to water, her hands started to shake She knew it couldn't be much farther, she could almost taste the cake Okay.